Well, hello there. This is Skip McCoy with Riversoft University. This segment is AR Roll Forward and Aging. A classic business accounting exercise is to tie two agings together by running one aging, adding the period sales, and subtracting the period's cash applied to equal the aging at the end of the period. The Air Balance and Roll Forward report does this for you. Here's an example. This is the aging report selection screen. You run one aging for January 1st, 2016. Run another one for February 1st, 2016. Now in order for it to balance easily with the AR balancing report, remember to click on show paid invoices. This will cause it to account for invoices throughout time so that it will match to the penny to your AR balancing and roll forward report. Also, make sure you're selecting the same filters. Show only the office totals and suppress details. So remember, click on Show Paid Invoices, Show Office Totals, Suppress Details, unclick everything else. Okay, if you do that, you're going to get two aging reports. One report for January 1st, right here. One report for February 1st, right here. Now, let's tie these two together with the AR Balancing and Roll Forward Report. So, you put in the exact same dates for your agings. January 1st, 2016. February 1st, 2016. Office 4. I'm suppressing the details and showing office totals. Okay, so my beginning aging as of January 1st is $134,224.46. That's this number. My aging as of February 1st, 2016 is $123,493.83. That's this number. Okay. The change in the accounts receivable between these two agings is $10,730.63. The invoice sales during that period, and that means January 2nd through February 1st, 2016, is $64,268.29. And the cash applied during that period to invoices created during over four is $74,934.67. So that's a change of $10,666.38. Now you can see these two are different. We have a balancing issue. If we ever have a balancing issue, there's going to be a table down here telling you why there's a balancing issue. And in this case, there was cash applied to an invoice during that period where the cash was not in that period. So we're out of balance by $64.25. You get to decide if the cash application date should be changed, but you can see Riversoft just reconciled your two aging reports and showed you exactly why they did not balance. Don't you wish all bookkeeping jobs were this easy? This is Skip McCoy from Riversoft University, signing off.